We are live. Hey guys, Des with T-Mobile, Susanna with T-Mobile. How are Hi you guys everyone. doing today? Welcome, welcome, welcome. We got lots of people already in the chat. And you guys, you might see some new faces on the screen. We've got Adrian and Kemper. Adrian, wave. Well, <laughs> there we go. Kemper, wave. Hello. <laughs> All right. <laughs> These are our Moto training guys. We talked about this. Should we call you the Motorola guys, Moto subject experts? They are our Moto training guys. Uh, and today we are unboxing. Susanna is actually going to do all the unboxing. You just get to hear me ramble the entire live stream. Uh, unboxing the new Moto G Play. So this is an entry level uh, value phone. Uh, and everybody says, you know, why are we why are we talking about this device? 4G LTE. $150. Uh, and we're going to show you what you can get for $150 because a lot of people are on a budget these days. They're shopping around. They're trying to make their money go a long way. And this is not a bad choice uh, if you're doing that. And so, Susanna, let's get into the unboxing here. I'm going to say hello to some folks in the live yeah, chat. Yeah, we have a lot of people saying hi. All right. Oh, we I, got see you guys, Adrian uh, I see you guys, Adrian. I see Jitsu. I see Panda Blocks. I see Angela's with us. I see Ederick is with us. Oh my gosh. Nam's with us. Raptor. Oh my gosh. So many folks. Sue, <laughs> is it? Sue, Sue from Motorola is watching you guys. The big body. <laughs> Be on your best behavior. So, uh, Adrian uh, and Kemper, why don't you tell us just a quick, like, 30 second version of who you guys are and, and how long you've been working for Moto? Sure. Uh, thank you so much, Des and Susanna. First, we want to start off by saying how honored we are to be a part of this uh, Tech Tuesdays. I know I always wait for that notification to come up. Oh, I've been with Motorola for about three and a half years now on the training team, creating some awesome content, talking all about the great phones that we have. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, my name is Kemper. I'm also on the training team. I've been here for about four years now. And uh, yeah, we just have so much fun here, right? It's Doing these live types of live shows and trying th new things out all the time. Nice, nice. Now I see you've got lots of little things on the table. You guys are going to be doing some camera demos and things like that. But Adrian, right in front of you, I see a Motorola Yeti tumbler. That's hot stuff, hot stuff. So if you guys are in the live chat on the live stream, we're going to give a few of those away thanks to our good friends at Motorola. So we appreciate it, you guys. Thanks so much. Susanna, are you ready to bring in the Razor cam? Oh, yeah, for sure. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so no, no <laughs> demo cam today. Here he is. Okay. I'm going to change things around. Let's jump in <laughs> live unboxing. There it is. Razor cam. So our demo cam has become a razor cam because we couldn't use anything else other than a moto product when our moto friends are online with us here today. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, I see some, some New York city Panda blocks, Panda blocks. Guess what? We're going to send you a Yeti moto tumbler. I think Panda blocks <laughs> called out our background. So there's our first Tumblr. Nice. One. Jump into that one down, more to go. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and get into this phone right off the bat. Wow. <laughs> so yeah. uh, talking Moto G Play, while you're pulling that out of the box, 6.5 inch HD plus max vision screen, as well as a 5,000 milliamp hour battery. Yeah. Look at that. There we go. Now we'll give us the you little tour. Yes, there we yep. go. USB-C charger. Love it. Love it. On the back, mm -hmm. fingerprint sensor. Yes. And a dual camera system. There it is. Nice. I love the focus oh, comes and into play. The headphone what is that? There's a hole in the top of your phone. <laughs> there we so go. Sorry, guys. There we go. My first Three time points. being demo cam today. <laughs> yes. Yeah, you got to play that. You got to play that autofocus game. I love it. Yeah. I love it. Okay. All right. Awesome. Let's pick what's inside uh, the box. I see Lisa Star loves loved her Moto Z2 so much. Oh, nice. All the mods. Remember that? Lisa, we're going to send you a Motorola Tumblr for being a fan. Thank you so much. All right. I see people are going, what's that hole? What's that hole? <laughs> Love it. All right, inside. So I'm sorry, I was I was being distracted you it already. But I showed them the SIM card, the SIM pin, now the uh, terms and conditions, and quick start nice. guide. Then nice. we have the USB C charging cable. Yep. And is it A to C? Yes, it is A to C. A to C. You know Perfect. what? Here. <laughs> there you go. There, there it is. Go. Nice. Okay. Yeah. Great. And the 10 watt charging block. 
Yes, not a turbocharger with this one, right? Just a just a standard 10 watt charger kind of. I mean, we're at a $150 price point. But I think I'm going to jump over to Adrian and Kemper. Susanna, thank you so much for that live unboxing. Yes, right? of course. I'm going to throw in these guys. I want these guys, they have all these great cameras. They're in a studio. They're not like you and I where we're in our home studio. They are in a legit studio. Uh, and they've been in their little bubble, the Adrian and Kemper bubble, bubble. So you guys are safe. Uh, there's no risk of COVID because you guys are our besties and you're always together doing training. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, we've been together since December. Yeah, yeah. We've been hanging out here in the I studio. I can't imagine. Yeah. I can't imagine. All right, all right. So let's look at some of the features. Now, I know you guys can do a camera demo for us. I'd love to also do a little uh, show off the screen. Uh, at this price point, I think for this device, fantastic device. Uh, we should cover the specs real quick. There we go. Love it. Thank yes, you for that. Yes, people asking about the megapixels for the camera. 13 megapixel dual camera on the back, right? Uh, I see Trey is uh, in here. He's answering all the questions. Huge battery can last two days. Uh, I don't know with my use. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to really work on that one. Uh, what version of Android Austin says it's 10 and it will get upgraded to 11. Uh, and there we go. I see Adrian is doing all the, the nice pan and demo shots there. You can see that five megapixel front facing camera. Can we scooch in on that one just a tiny bit? There we go. Like it. That's good right there. Perfect. Nice. Perfect. Nice. Uh, let's see. What else are people asking? What's the screen size? Juan Carlos wants to know 6.5 inch HD plus, uh, Adrian called out that it's a 20 by nine aspect ratio. So real wide cinematic, uh, screen. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Angela is asking if there's an SD card slot and yes, there is. <laughs> nice. Uh, nice. Yeah. I think we should send Angela a Tumblr. Great question. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Angela, Tumblr for you. I'm, I'm guessing like four Tumblrs I've given away already. Uh, when you take <laughs> you pictures, the wrong on, one does. <laughs> yeah. Oh, sorry, sorry. I got her. Angela's there. I, she went flying by. She's right there. There we go. Oh, there oh. it is. SD card and a Tumblr for Angela. So yes, and we talked about that before we went live. That SD card up to 512 uh, gigs, right? So. Yep. Uh, plenty of storage. Now on device, three gigs of RAM. Susanna, remind me on device storage. 32. 32, 32 gig device. on device storage. Oh, Among Us. I saw Among Us. We were talking oh, about yeah. for the next for the next one of these, we might have to do some Among Us live streaming. Yeah. We, have to, yeah. we have to get our, our Twitch channel going. I should start my own Twitch channel and just be Among Us. Play yeah, it all the time. All right? going. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> So let's see what else we've got. Uh, um, Carlos is asking about the RAM. It has three gigabytes of RAM. Yep, perfect, perfect. Um, and Adrian, you know what I'd love to see? Uh, in the camera UI, I know you've got the great camera angle to do this. You're just doing the, the phone demo right now. I would love to see that, what was it called, cutout camera? Yes, cutout. Uh, so with the dual camera, that second lens is actually a depth sensor. So it allows for really great portrait images and photos, but it also allows you to do something really cool called cutout, which allows you to really put you wherever you want to be. Uh, right now, we're, we're so used to uh, that 10 inches of snow here in Chicago. So I would like to be somewhere a little bit more tropical. Let's change the background. Uh, and again, this is pretty cool. You can kind of pinch and zoom. You can put yourself in there anywhere you want to go. Yeah. That's pretty awesome. This is like, we need this for, for uh, Jisoo when she makes our thumbnails. She just sticks yeah. our, little heads, our little heads in the desert, right? <laughs> this is how Kemper and I have been traveling since we have been quarantining here uh, for a while. This is how we get out. Yeah, with the cutout yeah. mode. But what a cool feature. And, and it allows you to, any picture that's in your uh, photo gallery, uh, well, you could use that as your background. So a lot of cool stuff you can do. With oh, that. nice, nice. Lisa says so cool. Lisa, did we give Lisa a mug yet? We should give Lisa a Tumblr. Not yet. Lisa Star, thank you so much for <laughs> the comment yeah. and Tumblr. All right. Hey, you know what we should do? Uh, Adrian and Kemper, why don't you guys take a picture of the Tumblr? Let's do a little oh, yeah. demonstration of camera call instead of that Rubik's cube. There you go. Nice. Let's see. Totally <laughs> fun. Totally fun. Uh, uh, people are glad there's an SD card, uh, pricing and availability. Oh, we've got the glare. That's better. Much no better. better. I like yeah. it. Okay. 
secret mode too. Oh, how big, cool. how big is it? Um, we didn't bring a comparison. How big is that Yeti tumbler? Is that about, uh, it, like my razor one that I've got here? Is that, this is probably eight inches tall, I'd say. <laughs> trying to guess. Yep. No, I think we're guessing. We're, yeah, we're trying to guess <laughs> how big the phone is. There you go. Nice. Yeti yeah, tumbler in one hand, Moto G play in the other. That's how we there like you it. There you go. I, one of the things about size of the device is it's a thicker device. It's got a 5,000 milliamp hour battery. That's what's getting you your two plus days of usage. LCD screen, uh, it's right. HD plus. It's not full HD, so it's a 720p plus mm -hmm. size. Great for consuming YouTube videos, uh, watching movies, things like that. Um, playing some games among us would be fine. You know, they're a, a, your casual games. Uh, I haven't played, I haven't played PUBG Mobile on it yet, uh, or or some of the other kind of more taxing games. Uh, people want to know how many colors does it come in? It comes in the blue. Yes, yep. the misty uh, blue. Um, on Paula asked if it's water resistant. Oh, let's let's talk about that. So it's water repellent. Correct. It's like what? Got to wear is a little raincoat. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, can you sometimes, sometimes you're in the store, you got to run to the car. There's a little bit of rain coming down. You know how it is out in Seattle. Uh, so this will this will definitely be able to handle that. So spills, splashes, accidental or not, uh, you know, it'll be able to to repel that. So IP52, I think, is the uh, the IP rating. Yeah. All right, and we get, we'll always follow up with that afterwards. Uh, so we'll follow up with IP rating afterwards. A lot mm -hmm. of people are asking how long. Uh, oh, look at Panda right there. Okay, I just we got to grab this one real quick. So there you go. That's worth that's worth a Yeti mug <laughs> right there, Panda. Verizon 18 looks sus. I love it. <laughs> um, so yeah, I think we'll follow up with some of these specs around the IP rating, if you will. Um, and uh, there was another question I was just looking at in the chat. I just want to make sure time wise. Oh, we're doing great on time. We got lots of yeah, time. plenty of time. Um, uh, and the reason why. So two things. I'm looking at the chat, getting questions to be able to put into social later to answer your questions. Um, these guys are our Motorola subject experts. They can answer all these kinds of questions. There was a question about how fast does it charge from 1% up? Now that's a 10 watt charger, so it's not a fast charger. Is that phone, um, if you have a bigger charging bank, can it handle a faster charge? Do you guys know off the top of your heads? That I do not know. I think with this one, it's the 10 watt. Because I know that there are some phones that come with like a 10 watt, but they're capable of 15 or 20 sure. watt. Uh, this one uh, is the 10 watt. Uh, yeah. So it is rapid charging. So you're still getting a decent amount uh, when the phone is you know, completely out. Uh, you'll get a nice boost if you leave it on there for about 15, 20 minutes. Yeah, and nice. that $150 price point, right? Yep. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Let's 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 remember what we're talking about. We're talking about one hundred and fifty dollars for a phone. So, uh, someone who maybe is newer to smartphones, or they're just going to consume. Uh, I've got a a ten year old that's a person who's watching. She's watching YouTube Kids all the time. So that would be a great example of someone yeah. who is uh, wondering. Chris W. Great question. That's worth the tumbler right there. Chris W. Uh, <laughs> is the charger included? It's a rare thing. This phone has both a headset jack and a charger in the box. Yeah. What? <laughs> yeah. It, it's rare, but for that price, you're getting your USB-A to USB-C charger. You're getting the travel adapter or wall charger, whatever you want to call it. In the box, there's a SIM pin ejector. There's either the T-Mobile SIM card or Metro by T-Mobile launching on both on Friday. Yeah. Uh, 150 bucks, like we talked about, which is fantastic. Um, I see someone wants to know if it has an easy mode. Uh, does Moto in your UI uh, have an easy mode? We stick with stock Android, and I feel like that's pretty easy, right? Yeah. The, the yeah. Stock Android, it's very simple. You, we don't have a bunch of different camera apps. You just have the one Google Photos app. Sure. Uh, Try sure. to keep very just stock Android, and hopefully that's pretty easy. Yeah, nice. It is, that is a great question. Uh, one of the things too that we like with this phone is the My UX, which allows you to customize a lot of your settings. So your font, the color, the background. You could even change the icon shapes. It's really cool, and that's all found in the Motorola app. So again, mm -hmm. we want to definitely keep it as clean as possible, and we only add what we feel like you need. So this is where you're going to find a lot of those cool like gestures, what nice. used to be called auto actions. 
Uh, but this personalization, uh, if we want to show that off, yeah. again, this allows you to change your style. So you can change depending on your outfit, on your mood, whatever the case might be. And you could customize this in so many different ways. Uh, but this will allow you to change the font to a bigger size, maybe uh, customize how your apps are set up on your on your device, so the grid. Uh, so you can kind of customize it to kind of fit the easy mode, right? To only see the, those important apps to get the font a little bit bigger um, and just to kind of keep what, what you want there. So I think the My UX is really great uh, for someone who's looking to customize and do a little bit something different with their device. Sure, I love how he said you can change your, change your fonts or your icons based on your outfit. What? <laughs> Coordinate. That's you a training guy right, right there. That's, that's, a, that's, that's a marketing message that just, yep, that was a marketing message that went right back out. Yeah. That was yeah. awesome. Yeah. Uh, okay. So I, <laughs> I see, will there be other variations of the Moto G on T Mobile? You'll have to, you'll have to wait and see. Yeah. Uh, I see questions about headphones. Are there headphones in the box? No headphones in the box, uh, but it is headphone compatible. Yeah. Uh, thanks to the 3.5 millimeter headset, Jack. Uh, I see uh, Trey, who's a Moto guy, talking about a 5G Ace coming to T-Mobile later. That's a, a step up on a device. Uh, kid to watch YouTube on. Uh, you're not wrong. Uh, easy for a four-year-old to navigate. Uh, four-year-old, that's you're a little early. I, we, we, but I, I get it. Yep, I, I, I get Frank it. Would disagree. He's oh. he just turned five, but he's already a pro. Uh oh. To, yeah. Uh oh. Yeah. Now, yeah. We're, now we're into it. We're let's see. Yeah. Let's see what else. Uh, um, South Lancaster is asking, um, what can the what is the highest the gigabytes go up to for the SD card? Uh, 512. Yeah, 512. Perfect. Uh, let's see what else we, oh, a lot of people want to know. So it is a 4G LTE device. And remember, T-Mobile's extended range LTE uh, coverage is fantastic. It's a 600 megahertz capable device. This is, this is stuff we used to talk about and we're all we ever talk about our 5G anymore. But it is a 600 megahertz capable device. Um, and you guys will remember a couple years ago, I went to Super Bowl as we're talking about the big game here, oh, if you yeah. will. Uh, coming up, right? Uh, and you guys saw me doing speed tests with the 4G LTE device in the 370 to 400 and 425 megabits uh, per second download speed. So, I mean, 4G LTE, especially on T-Mobile, is nothing to uh, nothing to snooze about. Uh, 5G is just even bigger, better, faster, uh, but then you're in a different price point for a device. Yeah. So let's see. Des <laughs> This yeah. year we'll have to Photoshop you in there with that cool feature. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, glass, what kind of glass is on the front? Do you guys know? Uh, uh, yeah, so it's uh, it's NEG, I think, or Dynorex. Okay, yeah. okay, good. That's a good one. We want the Moto X. People want the Moto X. Bluetooth, yeah, yeah. do you guys know what the Bluetooth uh, version is on this device? Uh, 5.0. 5.0, perfect, nice, nice. Yeah. Paul Lopez Gaming, Bluetooth 5.0, that was his question. Paul Lopez Gaming, Tumblr! <laughs> Tumblr. Yeah. Yeah. So what we're gonna have to do, I think you guys, is if we called you out and you're getting a Tumblr, uh, Moto's got uh, one of their social team members on here with us, uh, and we're gonna find a way to reach out to you either in the comments, uh, we've got our T-Mobile YouTube team on here, so uh, someone's gonna reach out to you and try to get you a Tumblr. Uh, you can always hit me up on Twitter if we called you out and you haven't heard from somebody. You can ping me on Twitter. Uh, we'll we'll get you the tumblers. We'll find it. Uh, find the way that I'd get that Yeti tumbler. That's awesome. Uh, let's see. Does it say hello Moto when you start it? Yes, it does. Okay. <laughs> yes, of course. Yeah. Of course. Got you. Oh, Got you. Uh, yeah. And you guys have some alarm sounds that are wow, startling. Yeah. Like some of the <laughs> <laughs> very, oh very loud. You're yeah. not going to miss that meeting. <laughs> yep, yep. Now, earlier I talked about this, and this is super important. Um, right as soon as this live stream is over with Susanna and I and Adrian and Kemper, we are going to premiere uh, the Moto G Play unboxing, our English language unboxing on our YouTube channel. You guys don't have to do anything. You stay right here on the live stream link. We'll go We'll go for about another six or seven minutes here answering questions and calling out features and doing demos. Uh, but then we will do a premiere. And uh, once that premiere airs, 
that will be a YouTube video, right? Just a normal on the T-Mobile channel YouTube video. You go into that video, drop a comment. Make sure you're subscribed to the channel. Make sure you share the video and drop a comment. Tell me who you want to give this uh, Moto G play to, and we're going to pick somebody out. We're going to send them, surprise, a brand new Moto G play from the Motorola team and T-Mobile. So <laughs> as soon as this one's over, as soon as this one's over, just stay right here. Don't go anywhere. Don't turn it off. Nothing. I see cool. I see great. I see keeping me in suspense. Uh, screen refresh wait 60 60 hertz i'm gonna assume That's 60 hertz yeah. yeah i mean the price point again yeah. this is a buck 50 everyone. <laughs> everybody's like i want 90 hertz i want <laughs> uh 12 gigs of ram i want 256 in the phone and i want it for a dollar 49 no yes. <laughs> 150 dollars. it is a great deal lots of uh lots of good features still so we played with the cutout camera um, what else we got in there? Let's see. Yeah, let's. We have this other great feature called spot color. Oh, let's yes. That down. Oh, that was pretty cool. Right? This is the, the weird Rubik's cube. What was that thing called? Yeah. Uh, that, you know, I don't know, but I think that's definitely my Rubik's cube since it's not solved yet. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> he got it off my desk. Yeah. Thanks, yeah. Amber. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Wow, well, that Rubik's cube just went to um, uh, okay. one of our enemy colors. Exactly. Um, so you can the the bug mobile. Now you're one of Dumb and Dumbers. There's the other Dumb and Dumber. <laughs> oh, nice. man. How about that nice yellow? Let's go to the yellow. We yellow. Like, yeah, we got like our, gold. our sprint team members. Yeah, can we get some yellow or some magenta, please? Yeah. So you can see there's yellow here, both on the book and on the Rubik's cube, and you can see it picks it up on both devices. Nice. Nice. Nah, so around. cool. Yeah. So what am I? What am I using spot color for, Susanna? What would you use it for? This is like uh, for a cool Instagram shot or yeah. uh, something like that. Yeah. When you have a cool, me, cool outfit or a top, you there you go. Focus only on this. We should do that. So, uh, Kemper or Adrian, do you guys have another G play with you there? We sure do. Can we? Yeah. Can I was gonna say let's get um, let's get Kemper holding out or let's get Adrian holding the G play like this. And we only want to see blue. Let's see. Let's see. So, yeah, I, I know. I understand that that will be off camera. I get it. So I've just made them go off camera. Here it goes. Oh, he's still gonna. He's still gonna try. Flip it around. <laughs> there you go. You wow. want it? You got it. There we go. There you go. You nice. just got the blue. Very cool. Very cool. Let's that is color. pretty awesome. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Hot colors. Awesome. There's a there's a feature uh, that's actually in the phone too that Google offers called Pop Color, which mm. takes your subject and keeps that subject all in color. So all the beautiful colors that person's wearing. This one highlights just one color, and then turns everything else black and white. So a little different, but very similar. But really yeah. cool. Yeah. Really cool. I, like, I feel like we could, cool. Susanna, we could use this for a lot of magenta type items. Yes. Well, I'm, me, I'm, I was thinking my roommate loves her plants. And so she's going to get all the green she wants. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. I love it. Perfect. Let's see. So I see rad function. Pretty cool. Uh, magenta color on the back is what they wish for. I love it. I love it. It does have face unlock. I know that's one thing we haven't mentioned. I know face unlock is one of the cool features a lot of people are looking for. Uh, so we, we've mentioned a lot about pricing, but some of the things you do get with the pricing is really cool, like the face unlock. Uh, same thing with the Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi. Uh, uh, you have Wi-Fi capabilities on the 2.4 gigs and also the 5 gigahertz, uh, which is really nice. So if you have, you know, uh, your own setup at the house uh, and you want to run it strictly on that 5, you know, something like this would definitely. Yeah. If, you it, it, Adrian, what you meant to say is if you have T-Mobile Home Internet, you can latch on to <laughs> the T-Mobile Home Internet yeah. with yeah, your yeah. Moto G yeah, let's run it back. Yeah, let's run it back. <laughs> yeah, just let, let's, let's just fix that real quick. Okay. <laughs> Make sure. He's new um, guy. Somebody's he doesn't, he doesn't do a lot of live streams with the T-Mobile folks yet. So yeah. <laughs> we had uh, we had somebody asking uh, Pranav about the frames per second per video. Oh, okay. Yeah. Talk to us about video. You know, this the, with that dual camera system, you're able to get some great video content. One of my favorite things is with the, the slow motion, the time lapse, and you can go into nice. the settings and you can see, you can customize just about everything that you want. So in here, you can change like the the, the frame rate that you want. You can change the focus. Uh, with here, it does record in FHD by default. 
Um, so there's some pretty cool things that you can fully customize and it's very easy and it's just tucked away right there in the, into the settings part of the camera. Nice. And like that photo size, uh, Kemper, show that one real quick. So photo size, yeah. uh, four by three aspect ratio. I did this the other day for a couple trying to get a picture, but well, not the other day. It was like Thanksgiving. Uh, and I was on vacation. I said, do you guys want the tall skinny photos so we can get your whole outfit and you guys together? And they were like, how do I do that? Um, a lot of people don't know. You can change your aspect ratio to four by three, 16 by nine, or in this case, 20 by nine. So super tall and skinny. Would, would that make me taller and skinnier maybe? <laughs> I, I, tried it, I tried it and it still doesn't work. So it still for me, doesn't work. Okay. For me, it yeah. hasn't worked yet. Yeah, we're trying though. Good to know. I was I was hopeful. Okay. And we are we're, we're looking at about... about Two to three more minutes, guys. Let's get uh, some of these last questions in there. Uh, Robin, Robin from Touch Stars on with us. Yay! Hey, Robin. So fantastic, so fantastic. Can the phone record in 4K 60 frames per second? I think we just talked about that. I, I think that's a little high uh, for this processor. Snapdragon 460, guys, am I right? 460, yeah. yep. three gigs of RAM. 32 gigs of onboard storage, expandable micro SD card slot. Um, pretty, pretty great specs. 150 bucks available Friday at your favorite T-Mobile store, T-Mobile.com, Metro by T-Mobile store and Metro by T-Mobile.com. All right, <laughs> cool. Let's see. Demo the speakers. Uh, yeah, Ronald said it. You're not going to get a $150 phone to do 4K60, but thank you for asking. Certainly. Yeah. Well, you get full uh, HD. You're going to get it to do Snapchat, which is perfect, right? Yeah. Exactly. Yes. Exactly. All right. Awesome. Panorama on the camera? Well, let me check. Yeah, we can. It, it does have yes. panorama. It oh, also yes. has live, live filter, which is a Google edition. You have mm -hmm. that pro where you can get into a little bit more of these details for if you are a photographer. Uh, then yeah, we have the cutout that we demoed, the spot color we demoed, and then because it has a depth sensor, you can really get some beautiful portraits. Nice, nice, nice. okay. Uh, but what's in the moto box on the left? Someone, you must have something on your desk that people are very excited oh. about. <laughs> yeah. uh, oh. yeah. What? Ooh. Right? <laughs> All yeah. right, does it have Android? Does it get Android updates like Google phone updates? Yes, it does. Uh, wish Maria wishes she could Snapchat that cute Tumblr. Maria, we're going to send you a Tumblr. Wow. Uh, I think that's our last Tumblr Yay. for this one. Uh, <laughs> very cool. So there's another Tumblr. Uh, and I've seen so many questions, so many questions. Susanna, what are you, what are you seeing in the – I want to wrap this up because we're going to get to premiere our video in like two minutes, two minutes. <laughs> So there's probably already a countdown starting. We got to wrap this sucker up. Let's see. Yes. Uh, yay, yay, yay. Ready to buy. People are oh loving it. Gosh. Yes, no, if, if I will you're, that. You're still with us. I see a ton of you guys actually are. Uh, Premier Moto G Play unboxing. Stay right here. We will click off of the live stream. We'll say goodbye. Thank you so much for watching. Um, go watch the video. Leave a comment. Make sure you're subscribed to the channel. We've got lots of good stuff for you. Uh, and share that video and, uh, I'll be in the comments looking for someone to, to, to gift a phone, a little surprise and delight. Uh, <laughs> let's see. Available now. Adri Adriana, I think is how you say it. Adriana. Uh, oh, no, I got the wrong one. I always do that. Here we go. Oh, there it is. No uh, relation. Friday. No relation. Yeah, available no relation. Friday. Fr so Friday. T-Mobile and Metro by T-Mobile stores. Awesome. Uh, Adrian and Kemper, I want to say thank you. Uh, we appreciate you guys coming on with us. Susanna, anything else you want to say? No, but actually one thing. I have... Oh, no, but yes. <laughs> what? Yeah, I changed my mind. Uh, no, we do have a Spanish version of this unboxing video. So if you want to check it out or share it to anybody that you know that speaks Spanish, go to uh, T-Mobile Latino and check that out as well. And subscribe and like the channel and do all, all the of things. Stuff. Yes. Thank you so much, you guys. All right. We're going to sign off. Stay right here. Live premiere coming up as soon as we end the broadcast. There'll be a little countdown timer kind of thing. Should be happening like any second. I'm going to end the broadcast now. Bye, guys. Thanks <laughs> so much. Thank you.